Three of Australian motor racing, Brock, Moffat and Johnson are all here at Bathurst this year and they drive cars almost as diverse as the personalities which drive them. Brock, seven times winner and the acclaimed king of the mountain, acts like royalty. He's popular without being pompous, proficient without being petty and to his fans, he's Peter Perfect. I think Bobby Morris invented that as a matter of fact because his kids used to watch the wa wacky races, you see, and I used to laugh about Bob and his kids watching the wacky races having this Peter Perfect bloke. But now my kids watch the wacky races, you see, they see Peter Perfect on there, and I mean, it's, it's just a joke here. Yeah. What do you think of your two arch rivals and their personalities, uh, namely Dick Johnson and Alan Yeah, Robert? well, they're totally different people, and uh, I think it shows that in uh, motor racing you really can't typecast racing drivers. You can't sit down and say, like, the devil may care, crazy, uh, playboy type people. They're not necessarily. Uh, sure, there's people involved in motor racing who are flamboyant and outrageous in various aspects of their behaviour, but... Uh, you look at Moffat, uh, very much an introvert, a uh, very private sort of person, and then you see Dick Johnson who is, uh, you know, he's just the average jock, a bloke, a uh, couple of cans of 4X and Dick's mate, you know. The three men are arch rivals, but Moffat holds high respect for both Johnson and Brock, and Moffat is conscious of his image. People, and particularly through the television medium, do tend to get a, an impression that uh, I'm some wild man from Kansas City, when I'm not. But you've also been described as introverted. Do you think that's an apt description? Yes, it is. I'm not, I'm not a uh, back slapper or a cocktail party set type. I never have been, so I'm not ashamed of that. Uh, some people are, are born to be uh, certain ways and other people are. I, I'm that way. I, I don't enjoy swanning around and big timing myself. Peter Brock describes Johnson as an easy-going ocker type, and Johnson doesn't disagree. Uh, I don't really try to portray to be someone that I'm really not. I just do my own thing in my own time, and if nobody likes it, well, that's just too bad. So the quick quips are, uh, are not premeditated? No, not really. They're just, uh, I'd say, just me. Would it be fair to say that you'd be one of the hardest drivers on the circuit? But I'm not unfair. I don't believe that I'm unfair. I won't punt anyone off the road on purpose or, you know, if I can't beat the guy fair and square, well, uh, you know, he beats me and good luck to him. Well, that's a behind-the-scenes look at the big three here at Mount Panorama this weekend. I hope you are watching Super 100 MBH. He's going to make the big charge under oh, brakes. Oh, Bryce. Oh, come on, Johnny Bowie. Oh, he sent Bryce it. off and I think there's going to be big trouble over that one.